Okay. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. Welcome back to some more CrossCode. I promise this time around I won't read every fucking thing in all of the data logs <clears throat> and talk to every NPC to completion <laughs> to the like final end of their um, dialogue tree and everything like that. Because I actually spent some time off camera, off stream, running around and doing that. I've read, like, a bunch of the data logs and everything like that. I spent, like, 45 minutes just walking around talking to people and reading things in my book that I have. Uh, so, yeah, I'm that kind of fucking weirdo. But now I feel like I'm a little bit more used to the gameplay, even though it's been a week and I've probably already forgotten what all the buttons do and everything like that. Um, so let's just uh, get into that shit, I guess. <laughs> Continue where we left off and uh, do some more crosscode. All right, so let's see if I can remember buttons. Left trick, left stick moves, right stick aims. That's my special, which I just used. And then right bumper is that. Left bumper is block. Left trigger opens up this menu. Oh, this also blocks. So B blocks <clears throat> and left bumper blocks. And then same thing if I want to use X or right bumper. Um, and then as far as I know, Y does nothing. Uh, bu bu bu. so what was I doing? There we go. This is what I want. Is it? No. I actually want to look at my quests, which I guess will be here. So Madman is talking to himself, and I. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, I mean, I know that I'm gonna be logging this in later. So, so there's got to be talking. I can't just sit here and wait for people to show up. I've got to provide future entertainment. Even if nobody ever watches the backlog on YouTube, there's got to be something there. Also, I am, can just, like, talk the paint off of the side of the house. So who cares? Hey, welcome back, by the way. Uh, let's see. So what was I even fucking doing? Okay, this. I need to find two more landmarks. I also need to find a probe. Broken Gauntlet is way above my level right now. I'm like level 10 or something. <clears throat> Gotta go find some ice. Uh, raw meat. I need to go kill some cows. More cows, because they drop the meat. Uh, I also need to get a spice set, which I need to figure out what the fuck that was. Inventory? No. Records. Trader book. Who sells the, th the spice thing? I forget what I need. I need like some sort of, um, oh, what is it called? A cicada or something. Spice set. Yeah, I need a bear cicada. I still have not figured out what that is. I think it's a rare plant that I just haven't stumbled across yet. So that's the last thing I need in order to complete. Oh, let me scroll back through this quest. Where'd it go? This one. And that'll complete that. Yay. Okay. And then the last thing that I need. What else? There's something. I lost my mind there for a second. Oh, yeah. You can actually... the. This is helpful. I never looked at this. So I can look at this and see what the drop chance is. So I need to beat one of these things, either a mad bovine or a red-eyed bovine, while I'm above a level C combo in order to defeat eight more to unlock this page. Oh, okay. Um, that's its Pokedex entry or something. Um, bup, 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 bup. So I need to go out and kill some more cows. I need, what, one more of thems or something like that? I believe. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Where was it? No, two more. And then I don't know what the other thing. I think I need to find the steak and the, the raw meat and then go back to uh, Miss Steak. Miss Teak, whatever. I don't know how to pronounce her name. Is it like steak, like Ms. Steak? Or is it Teak? And then it's, or is it Take, like a mistake? Or is it Teak, like Mystique, like she's mysterious? Or is she a uh shapeshifter like from x-men i don't know how to actually pronounce that i'm gonna say it's ms steak because that's like the joke her first name is selena so it'd be miss and then s period take or something like that whatever all right we gotta go kill some more cows and find some more other things to deal with i actually bought some of the bronze items because i was an idiot and didn't do that for a long time because i thought that everything had to be bartered with you couldn't just go and shop oh wait i need to remember how to do stuff that's not right Ugh! time to build up the combos nope don't do it ow 
Oh, I got an achievement. I'm also good at plumbing. I don't know what that was. Okay, now rank C. Moving on up in the world. Um, what have I done? Oh, I pressed select and stopped the combo. That's fine. Um, there we go. I want to see the map. So there's the lake. Now I need to remember like where I was. I can't go past here yet, and I forget why. I didn't take notes. I should take notes. I should get a notepad out like I've been doing for uh, Monster Sanctuary and actually take notes. Um, I just need to explore some more shit. So I'm right here right now. Let me just go up here and see what it is that I'm missing here. I think I need to be like a higher level or some shit, or I need like a certain item. Here, I'm just going to blast through these guys. Excuse me. I'm just gonna, I just want to go and look what it is that I'm missing. Whoops. I'm pressing the trigger now. Access denied. And it doesn't say why. There's Oh, I need to do like... F there's a fire insignia there on the top of these. So I guess I need to get fire orbs or something like that. Here's a glowing plant. Are you with what I need? No, you are not in fact a cicada. Which is what I desperately need. I can't make that jump. Um, And did I interact with that thing yet? Oh wait, can I even get up there? Hold on. How do you get up there? Is there a way to do that? Let's see. You jump from there to there, and there, and across. But how do we get up here? That's the big question. I don't see a way to do that. Um, same thing with getting across there. I don't want any more autumn leaves. There we go. That gets me across here. Talk to these people. Maybe? No? They're just kind of sitting, chilling, enjoying the view. Give me a cicada. What is this? Okay, now how do I get there? I guess I gotta run back. Let's run back. Eh! Eep. Oh, it's on top. Okay, so I need to do all this nonsense. Hold on, wait. Yep. Up. I did it. What are you? A master ball. What in God's name is that? Uh, inventory. But what does it do? <laughs> Can I use this to capture a monster? <laughs> I don't know. We'll figure it out later. That's that's a future crash problem. Okay. What's it doing? Right, so I need to, I need fire, I suppose, in order to get through that. So we're gonna boogie on somewhere else. Uh where are we headed? I've done... I haven't beaten this guy yet. I'm going to go down and defeat this Hedgehag. Since I haven't dealt with that yet. Um, now I'm a higher level. I feel like I can actually deal with it. I've also bought equipment. Oh, wait. I need to go up here first. And hop all the way across. Bip bop. Yeehaw. Oh, well, that guy's down there. I uh, pressed the wrong button. And I guess that she dealt with that other dude. Oh, I fell in too. Bip, find me a cow. Did you duel yet? Um, did I duel? Hold on. In this game? No, I don't think I have. Did you duel yet? I don't think I... That doesn't ring a bell. There are a lot of games that... I, here, I'm just going to stop this. Log that in. I'm pretty sure that I have not. Uh, grass head. No, I haven't done that yet. Oh my gosh, I keep pressing the wrong button. No, I haven't gotten there yet. Uh, so yeah, I'm going, yeah, I need to go up here. I 
But no, I have not gotten to that point yet. I've talked with him a second time. But I've yet to, um... Oh, that was cool. Oh, so if you roll into somebody, you can counter them? I thought you had to have your shield out. Or did I just happen to time that, like, exquisitely? Can I roll into an attacker to counter and block? No. That was, that was luck. <laughs> I happened to reach the end of my, um, spin. And, um... At just the right time. Uh, I don't want to jump down. Because I want to stay up here, right? To go... Oh, I can't look at my map yet. Okay, let's just close it out. Uh, yeah, I need to go... Oh, I can't jump down. Okay, well then we'll beat these guys up too. Why not? Single one dude out real quick. Fuck off. Oh, come back. Oh, problems. Ow. Oh, this, this fucking tree got in the way. <laughs> Yeah, we are on a roll. Uh, I don't see anybody else to attack. Oh, there's going to be more people here. Oh, excuse me. There we go. We're getting combos. Like, I'm getting used to... I mean, even from last time, just getting used to the, uh... Combat. Is fantastic. Also, uh, being able to actually deal damage because I've bought bronze weapons and everything like that. <laughs> huge, huge quality of life improvement. Uh-oh. Come on. Oh, I almost jumped in the way of that. Uh, I think that's everybody around here that have, like, cleared this out. Yeah, I don't see anybody else to start unless I... Start this fight with an A rank still going on. So now we're going to fight this boss. We're actually going to do it. I'm going to be successful. Ow. Right, he attacks twice. And then he has a big spin up. Look at me actually hitting for damage. Oh. Oh. Oh, problems. Oh, I did not get far enough away right there. Oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, no! That was close. I need to eat pretty soon. Yep. Oh, no! He doubled back really quick. Okay. So, let's let everybody heal up completely. I got him almost down to half health. I really pushed my luck there. I should have eaten since I got down to the point where I knew he was dealing about a hundred and something damage per hit and I got down to like 180. I should have healed. Okay. All right. 
But I was being greedy. Oh god, that's everybody. That is, in fact, everybody on the screen. Can we not right now? Can we just chill out for a second, everybody? There, we handled it. No problem. All right, we're going to log that. We're going to stop it. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Let's be real this time. Let's be safe, and I'll actually, like, eat food if I need to. I got him almost down halfway. Oh, oh he starts off with that. Interesting. Oh. Get the fuck away. No, I stopped spinning. I spun three times and it was a problem. Oh god. Oh no! He's chasing me. Okay. Oh god. Yeah, I'm letting... He spools that up a lot faster. Oh wow. Okay, so I need to do this and go to here. And I need to eat something that gives me just... Oops! No! What happened? I would need to keep holding it down. Oh wait. I want to eat... Sandwich. Hi, sandwich. I'll just eat a sandwich right now. That'll uh, give me enough to take another hit, at least. Alright, so now he's going into his special mode, which I don't know what it happens. Oh, he does kind of everything all at once. Yeah, I'm just going to keep my distance. Ow. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Wait for it. It's big time boss time. Vip! <laughs> big run away, spin, spin away. Hip. Oh god. Oh, it's just me now. Okay. Oh gosh! I thought I, I spun far enough away. We got him down really close there. Fuck! That's so hard. He just hit so hard. Oh, it definitely reminds me of a lot of games that I've played where you, the enemies hit as hard as you do, if not harder, and you can only take a couple of hits. Man, that's tough. Okay. Well, let's get back to it. He just covers so much ground with that spin. It's just difficult to deal with all at once.
Oh god. Alright, that should be everybody here. So we're gonna log on that stuff. Uh, we're gonna let everybody heal fully up. Alright, we got really close last time. Got really close with this boss fight. Guess just gotta grind it out, I guess. Just gotta grind it out. Oh, here comes the jump. I need to be more conservative with my spins, it feels like. Ugh. Oh god. Just give him a space. Don't do anything really risky and stupid. Yeah, that second attack is a lot faster. Yeah. Alright, so now he's going to do his special thing. So it's a zip and then a jump. Sometimes. Depends on if he's bouncing. So this is going to be the zip and jump. Oh, and that's when you spin. Oh, this is just going to be a zip. I did not get out of the way. Zip and jump. Here he comes. This is just a zip. Here it comes, and the jump. Woo! Oh, nope. Getting them really close. No SP. <laughs> that was not good to see right there. Did it. All right. Sweet. Boss down. Feels good. Came back and conquered it after last session. <laughs> Dealt with it. <laughs> it took three tries, but I did better every single time. So what did we get? Chili dog. <laughs> of course. Golden ring. Of course. Leveled up. Awesome. And what did we actually pick up now? A broken gauntlet. Okay. Okay. Hand over the broken gauntlet. Yay! So this is the thing that was uh, asking me to be level 15. To do, I believe. Oh, wait. Let me see this. This quest. Yeah, it was asking me to be level 15. I think I just hit level 11. Oh my gosh, I had no no idea that this was the... Wait, or was I just not realizing this? In an area where it rains, you have defeated lots of hedgehogs. So I should have, it didn't explicitly say you have to beat, like, the the Hedgehog boss or whatever in this quest. But, okay, but I did it. So I can hand that over. Okay, but the other thing I need to do is go to the circuit. Alright, so what have I done here? I have two uh, circuit points. So I can, it looks like I can take a level up somewhere. Um, so over here, this is the what? This is max hit points. So I can either, so now I can start getting passives. Increase the recovery speed from all negative status conditions, and then increase the not back dis distance of a charged projectile. Oh, it also branches this way. Hold on, wait. Increase the effect of healing and the duration of buffs by items at 25%. That's pretty dope. There's also this. So I have a lot of stuff to read down. Increase maximum hit point by 6%. Turbines how much hit points you can have to survive damage. Okay. Then over here, this is defense. So I can increase defense by 
Increase resistance to all elements. Then there's this. When guarding, reflect 30% of total absorbed damage back. That's pretty nice. I don't guard enough. I need to block more. <laughs> I need to get better at that timing. Uh, increase resistance to all elements. So that does the same thing as this. Okay. Um, focus plus 6%. Determines frequency of crits. Status effects. Okay. Increase the amount of range attacks damage. Okay. Increase the damage of critical strikes by 30%. Increase the invincibility when dashing by 20%. That's pretty dope. I uh, looked at that. And then this is increase attack just flat by 6%. Not just range, but anything. This is the one. Increase melee by 12%. Melee attacks fire additional small projectiles. Interesting. Increase the immunity to knockback. This is pretty cool. I don't know. I, I, I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm eventually going to continue leveling and get a lot of this stuff. So right now it's not a big deal. So I'm going to take this. That seems pretty cool. And I guess I can always like trade stuff out. There's I can go and pay to have somebody let me do like a re a retread on my abilities it seems like okay so i've leveled up all right and this is where um oop. this is where this ends okay well let's go turn that in from here wait from here can i just teleport i have to go to a teleporter promise fountain right isn't that right yes <laughs> I guess I could fight my way back and level up. Okay, then this guy was up and around here, I believe. I think it was down. Yeah. All right, let's hand it in. Welcome back, young lady. Did you find the broken gauntlet yet? Uh-huh. Oh, one second. Bit bop. Okay. Uh, really? Oh, yeah, I found it. This is very good. I knew I could count on you. Such a fine young lady with expert listening skills. <laughs> it's my big ears. Big big horns. Thanks a lot. I'm going to have a little something for you as a reward. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, I never asked uh, you for your name. I'm Dakar. Ketan Dakar. I don't know if that's from a thing. Leah, hi! <laughs> I can say those things. Well, I'm not so good with long goodbyes, so let's keep this one short. Two <laughs> deuces. Bye. Uh, I can't say bye. <laughs> a weird player with a broken armor from all classes trying to find a broken gauntlet. Okay. So, uh, you return the weapon. You learn nothing but his name. He gave me 100 experience and 1,000 credits. All right. Cool stuff. So, that's good. So, let's... Uh, look at our quests. Alright. So I need to finish this. I need to finish, the, I need to find the landmarks, which is just popping around. It looks like just going around all the different places. And this is finding the probe. So I just need to go and explore. And in the meantime, I need to find a cicada, bear cicada, so I can finish the spice set and beat up some cows. Alright, we got our work cut out for us. Let's head on back out into the world. Wait. Right, I can just teleport. <laughs> I need to get used to that, too. That I, I don't have to run there. Okay. I forgot. What do these guys sell? Spy, um... So I can turn a fruit set into spicy buns, which gives me extra attack. Okay, it's just increasing stats. <laughs> By 90 seconds. Okay. I need to buy that spice set. Need, spice set. Need that bear cicada. Alright. Um. I have gone that way. That's where the off road drippy den. Yeah. Okay. So I will just continue to the left over here, I guess. Oop. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm stranded over there now. <laughs> I 
Raw meat! Yay, I only need one more of those. Give me a thing. Gonna be out. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. We're good. Push him in the water. One thing at a time, please. Oh well, lost that. Okay. Still logged that experience and healed back up, so that's nice. I need to find a way to get up there. Oh wait. Looking at that. I may have to enter from another area. I don't see a way really to... Oh, no. That's what it is. Okay, so we gotta go here. Jump across. I'm not gonna worry about these dudes. We gotta jump across here. Then across here. And up, up. Figured it out. Oh my gosh! Fucking finally found some bear cicadas. Okay, hold on, wait. So that means... God, I've been looking everywhere for this shit. Okay. Now I can finish the... Uh, small time delivery. The wooden steaks, I might as well go get one more raw meat. Okay, and then we'll keep poking around. I can turn all this stuff in, like, all at once. Let me go back and beat up some cows. Uh, I need one more raw meat. So let's, uh, spawn some more cows. Will that do it? Or do I need to be at least two screens away for stuff to respawn? I actually don't know how the respawn works. These guys have not come back. Okay. Um. Trail rookie. I don't need to go to rookie harbor. Observatory. I don't think I need to go to the observatory yet. I might as well. Whatever. Fuck it. It's probably a, a um. Uh. Whatever point of interest or something. Oh, look! Something down here. Bip. Almost didn't get this. Twilight do. Um, a landmark that I need to go and explore. So now we're in some new areas. Okay. Fall back. Covering fire. Oh, he's mad. Punch him in the booty! Nothing. Uh, let's see. Is there more... To kill? Not really. I don't see any other guys. Okay. Oh. Yeah, we are on a roll. There's a lot of people to talk to here. 
Whatever. Let's just log it so we're not having the panic attack. Uh, there's stuff to look at here. Landmark discovered. I fucking knew it. It would be a landmark. There's a lot of people to talk to here. There's a princess back here. What you got? Code Knight. Hi! She's pretty! Are you a princess? Are you a Sailor Moon? There are many strange... Or Sailor Planet of some sort. Planetoid. There are many strange places in this world. Huh? <laughs> Later! Wait, did I already talk to her once? I don't know. It's so much in between. Oh, and there's probably something to activate all these triggers here. Anything hidden back here behind? No. Cannot go in here? To observe those who seek all elements is our duty. To protect the world from devastation. If you dare seek... If you, if you dare to seek our wisdom, then only what is broken can open this door. Okay. And these are the elements it looks like here. Okay. So, this building has no quest for me. But, I did... A bit bop. See another landmark. Okay. So where are we right now? Observatory. And it doesn't look like there's another exit out of here. So I'll have to double back. But it looks like you do go in here. Um, so I'm going to poke around here and see if there's... Uh, yeah, there's got to be a way up there to get... Um... Let's see how I can get around. Yep, here we go. Okay, up and around. Bip. Up. Oh. <laughs> Freaked out there for a second. One, two... Uh, is there anything over here? Oh, <laughs> that may actually be up a level, and I can't access that. Uh, let's see, from here, yeah, jump across, bip. And then across here, and then across here. There we go, figuring it out. A dungeon heart, what are you? Strange artifact used to banish monsters in caves. Okay. Uh, and then I guess I don't have any way to traverse anywhere around here. There's a dude around here that I can come talk to. Hi! Hey! It's nice here, isn't it? Uh-huh. Got him way past Autumn's Rise already, but it's still my favorite area. So I come back here to relax when I'm frustrated with the game. Ooh! Dude, I'm already just frustrated with the game. <laughs> no, I've gotten over it. It took me it took me a, a session or so to kind of get used to it. Um, like I said, I'm trying to remember, I guess, at the end of last session, that uh, I don't really play a whole lot of MMOs. I never really got into them. I tried, God help me, I tried to get into MMOs. I had several friends that were into several different, like, Guild Wars and... Um, was it... Is that what it's called? Guild Wars? I think it was one, Guild Wars 1 and 2. Um as well as World of Warcraft and Dungeons and Dragons Online. I just I just couldn't, for the life of me, get into it. Um, even playing with, like, playing with people, I always have fun playing with friends, no matter what I'm doing. Uh, I guess that's everything around here. I can't go any further south. What is that sound I keep hearing? It's, like, right around here. Oh, I see it. Oh, the, the enemies are coming back. Interesting. Right, they have to respawn. So that happens over time. That's interesting. Okay. So, what was I doing? Right. So, the whole process of, like, going and getting quests and doing all this stuff um, and and having the world to explore, I'm fine with... I'm used to open-world exploration games, but having all of these quests and shops and, like, you know, it's it's not as linear, and so I'm not as used to that. I'm used to playing something where it's like, all right, here's your next th place you're supposed to go, and on the way there, you can explore stuff, maybe have a, a side adventure, but really, ultimately, ultimately, you need to get here. And with this, it's just like, it's just spaghetti of what do you want to do? Then go for it. And I'm not used to that level of freedom. I I, I need a, a, a little bit of structure. I was one of those people that um, if uh, I had a project in school where it was like, right. Uh, two pages, like in like in English or something, where it's like write two pages about anything you want, any subject you want. Um, then you know, I I wouldn't be able to do it because I didn't have enough structure. It was like I needed to have something given to me. Or if it was like you're gonna be writing a, a, a research paper, 
on any book you want. And it's like, no, I can't. What do I pick? How do I start? But it would, if it was like, pick one of these books, these eight books from the list, because we're studying this author or whatever, then it's like, yay, structure. I can, I, I need a jumping off point. That's the biggest thing for me is getting started on anything is fucking difficult for me. Um, as it was for like doing Twitch, because I, I went above and beyond to set up all these like gifts and the layouts and all this kind of stuff because I wanted it to, from the get go, like look good. And this guy needs to simmer down a little bit, sir. Um, so getting started, a lot of times there's that choice paralysis is one thing, but another thing a lot of times is, um, oh, what am I doing? Is, uh, having too much freedom given to me. And so I don't know what is viable to start with. It's the same thing, like, I, I'm, I'm a musician, I, I write music and stuff like that, but really it's the jumping off point. I need to have, like, some sort of inspiration first, but once I have that, I can grasp onto it and really use it a lot. So I just need, the, I just need that impetus. Give me raw meat. Yay! Okay. Oh! There we go. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and cancel that out. Log all of the experience that I just got. And then... Okay, so, we have one more uh, b -b -b landmark to look at. We have to find the probe. We have to get ice. We have the cicada, now we can do the spice set. I'm gonna go ahead and buy the spice set real quick. Since I'm around here and this guy sells one. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Nice. So that quest is finished. Okay, so. Light wood and sharp wood. I haven't found any light wood or sharp wood yet. So I don't know how to do that. I guess I need to go punch some fucking trees or something. This is Minecraft now. Virgin Trail, Virgin Ice. Um, wasn't there a, a road map somewhere? You. Virgin Trail. Perfect. Road sign, rather. Learning. Making, making, making good on stuff. Uh, yeah. Virgin Trail. Okay. So, do, I, do I just fight stuff? Hold on, wait. Where's my, where's my status? Where is he? So I, I don't actually know. Here, let me see. So I need another, whatever, 420 experience. How much do... I'm going to actually look at something real quick. I haven't looked this up. How much experience? You give one experience. You give six. You give a lot. Okay. You give one experience as well. You give 20 and six. You give one and you give 88. So really, like, a lot of these, like, baby people aren't even worth fighting because they only give me one experience. They give me a little bit of money. But if I want to level up, I need to fight these red dudes, it seems like. So, like, if I see any of that shit. So, where is this? This is a new area for me. Pathway number five. Okay. Let's take it nice and easy here. Oh, ow. Rank C. Oh, problems. Uh, anyone else to fight? Oh, I can't, I d can't get up there. Yeah, I don't see anything else. Whatever. But we got something from that. We at least got a little something from that. Um, yeah, I don't see any, like, punchable trees to get light wood and sharp wood. I can't make that jump. 
Um. I'm just gonna explore the area first. This is a big new area. I can f punch these dudes later. This circles back around. Oh, now I can jump across. And this takes me over here. Look at all this cool stuff. Yeah, I'll fight these dudes later when I when I want to do like a an actual run. So I need to jump across here. I can't jump up here. Huh. Uh interesting. So there's nothing for me around here. Uh, as far as I can tell. Oh, I can do this, right? It's hard to tell what's the same level. Alright, now that I'm over here. Oh, look, a cave. Hillcat Cave. Alright. Oh, it's a bunch of these dudes. Okay. I think that's it. There's nothing else really to do around here. Really? Yeah, there's no other entrance or exit. It's just like you fight those dudes for reasons. Uh, uh, now, that being said, they do give 20 experience each, so it's 60 experience if I run in here. <laughs> But it, I guess they respawn over time. It's not like leaving some RPGs where you leave the screen, you come back, and they're just there. Um, okay, well, that's weird that that's just kind of there. Um, now we're here. What do we find? Okay. Huge radish that can be both fearsome weapon and a healthy meal. Okay, uh, let's see if it's any better. So I lose defense, but I gain health and <laughs> an attack. I'll take it. Interesting. Fear my, my radish attack. Okay. Um, let's see, I can jump back this way. Because there's stuff over here that I haven't explored. Oh, wait, no. Or have I? Uh, oh, i got to get up and around there. How do I do that? Oh, like this. I'm going to jump to here, and then across, and then to here. Yeah, I did it. Um, and then we got to hit this little thing. And i got a blue shell, which is what? Be able to be the bane of m many a conqueror. But can I use it on anything? Hold on, wait. No, it's just for trade. Okay. Let's talk to this dude. Does he have something to say? No, he's just kind of out here. Just kind of reminiscing. Okay, I guess uh, now let's beat up some stuff. Oh, fell in the water. Like a doofus. Ow. Ow. Uh, get up and punch this dude. I don't drop down there. Ow. Wait for it. Alright, now we're gonna jump back across. Nothing. Uh, that seems like it around here. 
I don't know if I'm gonna find anybody. Oh, wait. There we go. Uh, I guess let's continue on. Break his concentration. Oop. Wild shot. Uh, anybody else? Yeah, there's some guys down here. There we go. Anybody else? Um... Ow. Okay, well, that guy was a jerk. Okay, we're not going to make it back. I don't see anybody else. Uh, let's just save it. Log my experience. I'm so close to leveling! Oh, that guy probably would have leveled me up, too. Okay, was there anything down here that I needed to deal with? Oh, I didn't even see these dudes. Okay, this will probably... Nope. All right, let's log that. Level up, awesome. Uh, I don't think I have anything that I can spend one point in. I think everything that I have right now is two points, two circuit points. So I'm just gonna leave that alone. Oh. And we're gonna boogie on. As far as I can tell, there's nothing up this way either. Every single area, like small area, has so much to explore as well. Uh, oops, wrong button. Pathway 6. Okay, and there's an exit to the north, is what it looks like. Okay. Ba -ba -da -ba, nobody else to hit. There we go. I've angered this dude. Uh, anybody else? Oh, yeah. Oh, I got in the way. Like a buffoon. that we are on a roll i don't see anybody else to hit though uh, i don't see any enemies nope didn't make it in time okay hold on wait before i get to ah standing on this rock sucks uh, oh i can just make it here <laughs> so there's a lot to explore around here there's a new area this also goes north a little ways. Um, so let's go around and collect things. Pick stuff up off the ground. It's ours for the taking. All right, jump across. Oh, can't make it up there. My bad. I don't know if I need to keep collecting, like, all these common plants. If I just need to get as many as I can for any reason. Oh, hey! I found the probe. Awesome. So now I just need to find one more... Um... I just need to find one more landmark. 
Uh, let's see. How do I get up and around here? The only thing that I haven't found is, like, sharp wood or whatever. <clears throat> Into the waterfall. Nope. So I need to find a way up. Oh, I may have to go up here and then double back. Let me see. There's this. Yeah, I gotta take this all the way back, it seems. Something like that. Oh, hey, this guy has a quest. Awesome. What's up? Hey, you. Hi. I'm one of the testers for this game. Ooh. Devs asked me to test an almost finished new quest type, parkour. I'm kind of tired, and you just came along, so want to try it out? Oh, boy. Nice. Good to see some enthusiasm. All right. Get this. You will start right next to me. When you touch this checkpoint, another will pop up. Your goal is to walk through every marker until you hit the last one. And the last one is over there. It will only appear after you hit the last normal marker. Yeah, I know, but it's more fun than uh, that way, right? Well, at least if you like running. Also, if you leave the map, all your progress is lost. Another bummer, I know. Anyway, so I can't... In order to get to this dude, I had to leave the map and, and come back. Want to try? Um, sure, why not? Now, do I have a time limit, or is it just go? So I got to do this, and then up, and then across. Ooh, can I make this jump? Mm, barely. And then down here. And then down here, okay. Oops. Halfway through, okay. Easy enough so far. Did it. Oh, and he's just here. You did it. Great job. Yeah, smug. Super, super happy. And there was no problem, right? No sudden shocks or anything? Uh, I did fall in the water once. No. Great. Great. Thanks a lot. Take this for your efforts. I hope we can meet again. So you can help me again. You know? Ugh. <laughs> So I got a sandwich, a high sandwich, a chef sandwich, experience, and money. The testers seemed pretty satisfied with your performance. He even told you that you could help him in the future. You can't decide if that is a good thing or not. Hey, that was easy experience, easy money. So I'm going to roll with it. Okay. Um, so but that being said, now we have to run this whole gauntlet again real quick because I didn't get those items. Oh, yeah, this is right. Mm, mm, mm. Where do we start from? Up here? Yeah. Oh, hey! Wait. How do you get there? Up and around. Uh, looks like you double back on that upper slope. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna wait. So in order to do that, I have to get up here. Oh, I can't cross this wall. <gasps> Ooh, tricky. So I can't cross that wall, so I have to find a way to get up there some other way. And I don't see a platform that takes me up. So that means I have to jump across from there, probably. Chris Christophorus? <laughs> Who's this dude? Hi. Yes, what is it? Uh, let me guess. Wonder how to reach this chest. Uh, sure. Figured. Well, you may have realized this already, but jumping from here on this... Wait, jumping from here on this pillars is not the right solution. No, you'll have to find another way. In fact, it's a very roundabout path to reach it. Do you want to know more? I suggest you try to find yourself. It's more rewarding. The way yourself. Yeah, I do not want to know anymore. That's the spirit. So maybe now I can enjoy a quiet moment here. 
Oh, what a jerk. It's okay. I can't refuse a fellow traveler in need. Thanks, dude. Okay. So it's a roundabout way to get there. And once I do, then I can take this up and around to get the rest of the way. It looks like. Maybe? I don't know. So let's go explore that. 